Tuesday. I don't think I vlogged yesterday. I, I can't have done that very much. I'm not exactly sure. I feel like, weirdly, I sometimes just don't vlog on Mondays. I never seem to start off the weekly vlog at the start of the week, which is a bit weird. I don't know why I do that. I've just cleaned the house and I just went for a really long walk because whilst it's been super windy here in Brisbane at the moment, today specifically, it's still sunny and the sky is blue and it's not raining. So that is making me very happy. I, I've missed the sun. You don't realize how much you miss the sun until it's gone. Because for a while there, I didn't see the sun for a good two weeks. And I definitely, it made me feel a bit sad, you know? And then I finished Nine Perfect Strangers yesterday and I loved it. I loved it. It was so good. I, I, it, I think it was 500 pages and I finished it within like two and a half days. Like I just like didn't put it down. I just thought that like the character development and the plot was so interesting. And a lot of stuff happened that I would just never expect to happen. So now I'm on to the guest list. That's what I'm reading now. Although I've only read like a chapter of it, so I can't say anything about it. It is Friday and I had a super nice kind of slow morning. I've just been kind of watched some YouTube videos in bed and read it for an hour or so. I mean, it's still only just going 10 o'clock now. I feel like half my day's already been done when I don't work in the morning because I still wake up super early because I'm tired to go to bed at like 8 p.m. at night. Still, even when I don't have to be up super early the next day, my body's just clocked into that new routine. So I haven't done my makeup in a really, really long time. I don't wear makeup to work because who can be bothered doing makeup at freaking uh, four in the morning and I'd have to get up earlier. This is a bit weird. I've been wanting, I wanted to feel a bit um more put together. I'm really excited. I'm getting three tattoos today. You'll see what they are a bit later. Two of the same and one different. That doesn't make any sense now, but it will later when I show you. The place is about half an hour away, so I'll leave somewhat soon. But I feel like tattoos are like a weird form of self-care to me. Like uh, when I get a tattoo, I just feel like better about myself. So yeah, so I'm going to go get those tattoos today. The appointment was at 11, but she said she's running behind. So it's going to be at 11.30 now, which is more than fine because I was just kind of chilling around here anyway. And... I really want to finish my book that I've been reading, The Guest List. It's getting really good. It took me a while to get into it. I think it's just because I was reading in such short intervals, like I'd only read it for like 10-15 minutes at a time because I was kind of busy, but after I kind of sat down for a little while to, to read it, I kind of got stuck into it and now it's getting pretty good and I'm almost done with it. And I've got two books waiting for me at the library, Malibu Rising, which I'm so excited to read because I've just not that long ago I read The Seven Half Spins of Evelyn Hugo. And I also have The Silent Patient, which is a very highly anticipated read for me. Everyone said it's so good and as you might know, I like that kind of darker style of read. So I think I will really, really enjoy that. And I'm really excited, but I'm forcing myself to finish the books that I have before they're due back at the library first. Yeah, that's the plan for today. I'm so excited to get these tattoos. It's been... I haven't got a tattoo since like December because you're not allowed to swim when you have tattoos so I've been not getting any because it's been summer and it's been so hot that we have to swim all the time. But now that it's winter I haven't swam in months and months and months so it's tattoo season again as I say. You know, I in winter I just get a whole bunch of tattoos all at one time. My mum hates it but I love it so, sorry mum.
tattoos done. Yeah, I think I was there for about three hours because I got three separate ones done. You would have seen just seen what I got done. So I got the two like eyes on my the bottom of my shin. And can I tell you that was some pure painful stuff going on there. That was excruciating, especially my left leg. For some reason it hurt a lot more than the right. But yeah, that was crazy painful. I think my second most painful tattoo as opposed to one on the back of my calf. I reckon that was the most painful one. And then I got the cute little fruit stamp on my arm. That one had a little bit, but nothing crazy. I feel like arm tattoos really don't hurt nearly as much. But she was such a lovely artist and I really love her style. I'll put her name here. She's in Camp Hill in Brisbane. But yeah, and then I just came home I'm watching some Grey's Anatomy. I've had some lunch, I'm just kind of chilling out, kind of de-stressing after that. You're not sleeping. <laughs> Stop. Cool. Good morning everyone. It is Saturday and we're just heading off to the farmer's market and we're going to do a bunch of stuff today. So we're going to go to the farmer's market and then we're going to hit a couple of op shops and then I need to go to the library. And then later today we're going to the movies. We're seeing the new Charlie XCX documentary and I am so excited for that. So yeah, that's the plan for today. I'll take you along with me. shops and what else do we do we went to the farmers market that was so nice that was like the biggest farmers market I've ever been to it was in West End and we got some brekkie I had this really good like lamb roll thing and coffee and got some like produce and stuff and then we went to a couple of op shops kind of up north area and they were like the huge big like lifeline and binnies and I haven't had any luck yet in Brisbane with clothing and we struck gold there. I found some really cool stuff I would have just shown you. I got a couple of books and it was so busy in there. Like really busy for a Saturday. And then just went to the library and picked up a couple of holds I have. And we're just going to kind of chill out and have lunch. And then we're going to go to the movies. Oh, oh, oh. 